hello today i'm here with a new video and today i'm here with the pal of bingo with the menagerie cosmetics dragon child this palette is not available as a palette but you can buy all the single shadows so yeah i'm doing a palette bingo with this one and i am going to do a palette bingo with all my menagerie cosmetics palettes but I haven't got the Whale Song palette when I'm recording this. So I wanted to do with this one and then I will do a first impression palette bingo I think with the Whale Song palette and then I will do a palette bingo with, with all the three palettes I have. So, okay, <laughs> this palette has 12 shades and look like this and we had have we have had some troubles me in this palette but now we are friends. We are really good friends. I really like it. So I am going to random.org. I'm just gonna find random.org. Maybe I could have been a little prepared. And I don't know how to film a screen. So I think I will do like this. If I hold it next to my face, it should be in focus and I can generate for you and you can see it. So we start 11 and I will pick five colors. I don't think I said it. So 11, 9, 7, 9 again, 11 again, 12. So 7, 9, 11 and 12 and the last one, 12 again, 2. So we will see here. Okay, so this is my color story. It's a pretty deep dark story so this is number two seven nine eleven and twelve I hope I got that correct so it is maybe you won't see in the palette number two this myth or legend number seven flame tongue and number nine smoke em out eleven worm and twelve mother dragon so I will take away the swatches, I will think a little bit what I want to do with this and then I will be back and we just start with this makeup. Okay, I think I have decided what I want to do. I will start with Flame Tongue, this one, and put it in my crease, in my whole crease. And I'm not sure if the look I have planned is going to, if I'm going to be able to do this. But we will try, so I will take this in my whole crease, as I said, and I forgot just how pigmented this shadow is. You maybe can see that I forgot it, because I have so darn much shadow. These are really crazy pigmented. Feels like I almost want to do this all over again, to just start over, but... Okay. This was not what I had planned. It is a little bit too much, but okay. I think I can work this out. So okay, don't do like me, don't take too much. So for my other eye, I don't want to take that much, but now... If I fucked up that eye, I need to fuck this up this eye as well. And if you haven't seen my um, Free Looks 1 palette with this, I will leave it up here. Uh, I, uh, 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 I did a review part in that and I didn't give this palette the greatest review. But I was also like, I don't want to give up on it because I want to love this palette. So I used it a little bit off cam and then I did uh, Get Red With Me where I used it and it will come up up here as well. I changed my mind and now I really like this palette. The only thing is the shadows, you have to work with them a little bit different like this flame tongue is uh, not a problem at all to 
do like this but you can't use a fluffy brush like this and smudge all the shadows out in the crease it's just it is impossible but you can work with them with other techniques so then I'm going to take smoke them out this gray no no yes no yes no I will take a flame tongue again on a fluffier brush and put it out here and this is one of my absolute favorite colors in this palette I think this color is amazing I used it in my first impression I think did I? yeah I'm pretty sure I did okay and then I will go in with or should I take Mother Dragon? No, I will take smoke them out and go in with a pretty pointy fluffy blending brush and take this in my crease. Okay, so I just take a little bit of this in my crease and just in the outer part of my crease. I will smudge it in but like not take it the whole way in and so not so much the whole way in and then I also will take this brush this is small tapered blending E45 and take smoke them out as well and I will put this out here and blend it inwards and now okay, I don't know I don't know if you can hear it, but it's a child crying outside. Then I will go in with flame tongue again and put it here. Put it here again. And just smudge it a little bit more. In together with the smoke em out. And then I will take this brush again and just smoke it out okay and then for my inner part of the eye I will take this myth or legend and maybe this isn't the best choice but I really 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 want to use this and I tap this off because I think this is crazy pigmented as well and okay now we will see if these are there is a risk that these two will muddy together because just the case but I think if I'm going in in small small motions okay and then I will take flame tongue again because it feels like I take took myth or legend a little bit too far okay so I will also go in with flame tongue okay no I will just take the brush brush that I took flame tongue with and just try to blend the edge a little here and now I have like flame tongue all over my f eye area fire area Okay, what do I feel about this look? I have no idea. I am okay with it, I think. Maybe it's even good. I don't really know. I don't like my crease area. I, I took it too high up, but it's a little bit late to change that and I think it will look better when I have my brows on I at least hope so I will fix the other eye my base my brows and then we are going to finish this look and we have these two left so I will fix all of this and then I will come will come back and yeah and then we will be done 
So the face and brows are on and for my under eyes we have two shadows left and I will start with a mud dragon and take it on the outer half of my lower lash and And what I can remember, this is a pretty dark shade. So I will go in with a lighter hand. Let's tap it off. And lift this super concentrator. Something like that. And then I will take the Vroom. This purple one and put it... Maybe I should take Mother Dragon a little further in. Something like that. And then I will take Virum and put it in here. And I hope it will go good with Myth or Legend. Because that was my plan, at least. Okay, what do you think about this? This was maybe not that bad. Okay, so something like this. I think I am actually pretty happy with it. Sure, if I could have chosen I, if it wasn't the palette bingo, I would love to have that one in my inner corner, but instead of the purple one, but uh, I didn't get that, so this is what I got. So I will put something in my waterline, put on mascara and the lipstick, and then I will be back and you will see the whole finished look. So this is the finished look for lips. I took Unicorn Blood from Your Free Star, which I totally fucked up, but I am not going to try to take it away and then put on new because it's only getting worse. So we got that little situation. So this is my look with the palette bingo with Dragon Drive from Naughty Cosmetics. And as I said in the beginning, this is not available as palettes anymore, but you can buy all the shadows as singles if you want to. So what do I think about this look? I am happy with this look, even though it's much lily. I wouldn't mind to get one of the shimmers and maybe got some lighter colors because it has been very many dark looks at my channel it at least feels like that so i would love if i maybe could have got some of these lighter shades and one of the shimmers but i like this look i i think it's good so this was my palette bingo with the dragon child palette and i really hope you like that and i will try to do more palette bingos because i think it's fun but I just just don't do them. I don't know why. So I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!